single stage regulator contains a single diaphragm and valve. High pressure gas enters the regulator through the inlet into the high pressure chamber or the valve chamber. The pressure is indicated by the inlet pressure gauge fitted to the regulator. The gas fills the high pressure chamber or valve chamber completely. As the valve remains closed without any external interference, the high pressure gas remains contained in the valve chamber. When the adjusting knob is turned clockwise, it compresses the rain spring and exerts a downward force on the diaphragm. which in turn pushes the valve stem open. This releases gas into the low pressure chamber, exerting an opposing force on the diaphragm. An equilibrium is reached when the rain spring force acting downwards on the diaphragm is equal to the combined upward forces of the gas in the low pressure chamber, the upward force exerted by the valve spring and the upward force of the high pressure gas in valve chamber acting on the valve. While the regulator is in use, the initial high pressure starts to drop at source as the cylinder empties. The reduced pressure in the valve chamber means lesser upward force of the high pressure gas in the valve chamber acting on the valve. Thus, the total combined upward forces of the gas in the low pressure chamber, the upward force exerted by the valve spring and the upward force of the high pressure gas in valve chamber acting on the valve becoming lesser than the downward force on the diaphragm exerted by the rain spring. Now that there is less upward force on the diaphragm than the downward force exerted by the rain spring, so the diaphragm travels farther down, making the valve farther open and allowing more gas to fill the low pressure chamber, resulting an increase in the outlet pressure as indicated by the outlet pressure gauge. Once the cylinder is empty of the inlet gas flow shuts off, the outlet pressure drops to zero as shown or indicated in the outlet pressure gauge.
A typical delivery pressure curve for a single stage regulator if plotted with the outlet pressure on the left hand side and the cylinder pressure down below. You can find that for a high flow application, the delivery pressure increases continuously throughout the diminishing cylinder pressure, whereas in case of a low flow application, the delivery pressure increases when the cylinder pressure reaches somewhere around 50 kg per centimeter square.